it's Professor Josh. Welcome back for another video. Today we got some exciting stuff, especially this box I have over here. So this box is full of grails. So I have the grail box right here. So this box is full of grails and I already know it's full of grails because it's a mystery box with lots of grails. Um, so stick around to find out that and some more pickups and some fun sodas. So stick around. Alright, so welcome back. So, we have a grail box over here. I know you're anxious to see the grail box. Before we get into stacks and pawn stacks, hopefully, of awesome grails, um, I'm going to open up a mail call. You know, I love mail calls. So, we got a mail call over here. Um, this is from my friend Rock and Row. So, if you haven't checked out his channel, his channel's great. He does a lot of sodas, like way more than me. And I know I do a lot of sodas, but check out his latest video. You'll see lots of sodas um, and all kinds of great things. So, go check him out, sub. I'll link him below. But we did a trade. He had something I wanted. Um, I had something he wanted. We we're like, let's help each other out. So this is actually some stacks, not necessarily grails yet, maybe, but some stacks. So I'll show them what, what I got. So, oh, here we go. All right, first up, we got this Batman. This is probably my favorite one from the artist series. Definitely one I must, I really had to have in my collection. Um, really was looking forward to this one, but this is a cool one. I'm still looking for the other Batman ones. Uh, I went today uh, or yesterday, you know, while you're watching this, I went on Sunday when they dropped. Man, ugh, so disappointed. Oh, and I got a bunch of goodies in here too, so we'll show those off in a minute. And then this one is pretty cool too. So another stack here. We got the stacks. I love the artist series comes in these stacks, keeps them nice and protected. Um, but they're cool because each one's a little different of where it's going to be placed and what it looks like. So glad to pick these up. Thank you, actually. Thank you, Jim, for sending these over. And great to do a trade with you. Good job packing. Good pack. And then we got all kinds of stickers. We got his Chase Soda hologram sticker to add to our collection. So pretty cool. We got his rockin' roulette sticker. So he does a lot of chase roulette as well, too. Has some fun with those. We did one together just recently on a live. If you haven't checked it out. I got some chase, limited chase ones. So a cool coaster as well. And then, of course, the rock and row. Subscribe the cool surfer chase sticker. So this, these are cool. Thanks for sending these over with the package. I really appreciate it. And... Like I said, if you haven't checked him out, go give him a sub. I think he just is about to reach his next milestone, so it'd be great to go check him out and see what it is. So, I got one other thing I wanted to show off. Um, so, I picked this up on Sunday at Box Lunch. It dropped. It glows in the dark. Oh, yes, from Coco. Uh, this is an awesome piece. So, Papita, all right? Papita? Uh, yeah, all right. Uh, so this is an awesome, awesome piece. I'm surprised they were still on the shelves. We went like in the afternoon, we were looking, they were still there. So I grabbed, grabbed them. I can't wait to check out the glow on him. So I'll show you the glow as well. So I'll do some pictures, put them up there, show you the glow, get them out of box and everything. And um, we'll save that for a little later for you in the video, but definitely stick around because I know you won't want to miss these grails. Uh, but before we get into grails, I have some sodas I've been wanting to open. You're like, ah, oh, sodas. Well, perfect, right? We just just showed you my pickup from uh, Rock and Row, and he loves sodas, so I might as well try some sodas out myself. So this is Batgirl. Batgirl is what? Fifteen thousand pieces. Sodas keep going up. Fifteen thousand, twenty thousand. I really liked when they were like ten thousand, five thousand, six thousand. Glad to see the con ones are staying low. Um, that's good to know. I'll have some more of those coming soon. I think some more. A uh, couple of MV Adams and Spike Ores. I can't wait to try those. Open those up and get those Grails as well. But let's see if we can find the metallic Batgirl. These are so light too. All these are so much lighter than than other ones have been. Um, so I've seen a couple people open these and get the chase. 
So I'm hoping for the chase. I just want to be like, I got four here. I want to be done. I want to be done with it. All right, so won't look at the fog. It's in there though. Won't look at it. The lid right back on top. Yeah, she's so tiny. She seems like so much tinier than a lot of other ones. I'll have to grab one of my other sodas just so you can see how much smaller she probably is. All right, so I don't think this is the chase. This looks like the regular one, but still a really cool piece. But man, it feels so light. I don't know if it's so much thinner, even Freddy. Yeah, it, it's a, such a different piece. So I grab Freddy here. She's so much thinner. So if you see like comparison between the two, it's, it's so interesting. But yeah, she's tiny and light. So all right, so we got one down. We're no chase, but we got a common. It's always good. Let's see. Yep, twelve thousand five hundred commons. So pretty good amount of commons. Uh, not necessarily my favorite thing to have, you know, that many. But we're going for that chase, of course. That's what we're really going for. So let's see if we can find that. All right, next one up. Open this up. Don't look at the pog again. I don't like looking at the pog. I'm going to go straight for the bag. Straight for the bag. Hopefully. Did I get it? Did I get it? Did we get it? Um, I think we might have got it. This is it? This looks like it's it. It's all metallic -y, gold. Uh-oh. I think we got the chase. I'll have to show you some close-up pictures. She's so tiny. Hard to see. I'll back up kind of so you can see a little bit. But I think we just got the chase and we did on our second one. Found the chase. One of 2,500. Ah, that's so nice. So let's go ahead and open the two others. Let's see if could we get more than one chase. I don't know. Or should we just leave it at that? Leave it at that. Leave these two sealed. Never know. Hmm. All right. Let's go for it. Let's see. I want to know if I got two chases or only one chase. So I think, I, I'm trying to remember where I ordered these from. I think Funko Shop. So is there a possibility of getting two chases from one order from the Funko Shop or not? I don't know. We got one chase. Cool. I like the gold look instead of the yellow, like the metallic -y gold. Uh, nope. It's the common. So what do you think? The last one, common or chase? A common or a chase? I don't know. Hmm. I'm thinking, thinking another common. I don't know though. We can try. We can find out. Like I said, I'm not gonna look at the fog. No fun in that. I'll open it for you. At least get a peek in there. Let you have a peek maybe before I do. Is it? Is it? Oh, 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 that's a common. So we were right. So we ordered, we got one out of four. Not a surprise there. We could have left the other two sealed, but yeah, we'll open them. We'll find out. Um, I'm sure someone will want to win one of these Batgirls. If you don't have a Batgirl and want to win, I got a hashtag for you and we'll do a giveaway on an upcoming live. Maybe not the, tonight's live. So we will be doing tonight's live doing Mail Call Monday. Um, maybe we'll do it on Mail Call Monday. Maybe we'll do it next Monday. Maybe we'll give a whole week for everyone to comment. Hashtag Grails. Hashtag Grails. So, because we're about ready to open some Grails up, hashtag Grails, you get a chance to win a common Batgirl. So a common Batgirl and maybe some other surprises. Got some really cool new stickers in and things like that. So, Send those over, hashtag grails, and we'll see if you win something good. But cool, we are done now with common in the chase of Batgirl. Whew, glad, because I don't want to keep buying, buying, buying crazy amounts of sodas. I'm glad to have that. All right, so we got the big boy, the big box. You're wondering what's going on with this box. So this is from the Grail box, and they sent out like an email. I don't even know if they posted on their Instagram or anything. Sent out an email to customers that bought before from them. And it was like, oh, we have a box here. It's a $700 box, not a cheap box, $700 box. So it better be full of good stuff with over almost a thousand dollars of value. So it was like over to like $950 worth of value supposed to be in this box. 
for $700 in shipping and those kind of things. But, wow, that kind of value, I want to see what's in here. I was interested. I think they only had one box, and I grabbed it. So, let's see how crazy I am with this box. Um, I'm hoping some good stuff in here for me, if not for maybe someone else that I know that I want to trade or sell, or maybe I, you know, I have upcoming whatnot auction on November 11th. Maybe I'll have something for sale there, but it's supposed to be, I think if I remember right, five pops, four grails, one like mid-size one. So I don't know if we can feel around. This is the first time I'm going to feel around and feel like probably stack. Uh, stack, pop armor stack. I can feel like the kind of different kind of stack. Oh, another stack. Oh, wait, there's a non-stack. All right. <laughs> oh, wait, there's six pops in here. So maybe there's two not in stacks. Maybe I got an extra bonus one. I don't know. I thought there was only supposed to be five, but maybe two. Let's see what they are and let's see the kind of value we have. We'll have to add this up. All right. One, two, three. Oh. Oh, God's of War. Krota. Krotos. Krotos, PlayStation official product. God's of War, number 269. I am not sure on value on this guy. So let's kind of add up as we go along. Um, let's have some fun. Add these up and see what we got. So... I've never pulled him before, definitely. Um, a vaulted pop, $36, so he must be like a lower pop, kind of added in there for some extra value, which is cool. Um, but I'm looking forward to the big boys, but this one's a good one to have if you're into gaming. I'm sure if you're into Gods of War, it's probably on your list to have. It's cool vaulted pop. Um, some of these gaming pops really go up in price over time as well. All right, so we have, like I said, Four in stacks, and one more in a soft protector. So, soft protector, here we go. One, two, three. Oh, it is a oh, black suit Spider-Man. You know what? I think I recently pulled this one. For some reason, I swear I recently pulled this one or had this one. Um, but it is a cool piece. So, black suit Spider-Man. So, we got 36 for our first pop. What is he going for? 30. So these ones both are only coming in at, what, so 60, 66 dollars? So a 30 and a 36? Uh oh, I'm scared. Should I be scared? Or maybe bring in some heat. So we got 66 dollars here coming up. Um, uh, cool pop though. I believe I have this one for some reason. Um, but looking forward to, if I don't, if I have them, I'll definitely have them up for sale, that type of thing. But, like I said, now it's stacks and one in pop armor. I'll leave the pop armor for last. How about that? Leave the pop armor for last. We'll go for some stacks. What kind of things would I be hoping for? Of course, Marvel Grails that I don't have. Um, maybe a Horror Grail. It's Halloween time, right? Throw something like that in. Uh, let's see. What else? Of course, Star Wars. Star Wars right now. It's going to be going up, up, up. And then we got... Just some cool older movies and things like that. Some things I'm looking for. Hopefully it's not all stuff I have, but we'll find out. I doubt it's all the stuff I have. But, alright. I don't know what's front or back, um, but I have not looked at this one. I can feel the stack, and that's why I don't know if it's front or back. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, I gotta turn it around. It's NBA Pop. It is Mr. LeBron James when he was with the Miami Heat. So number one, number one of the NBA pop. I know this definitely has some good value to it. Um, I know there's two different versions of this pop. I believe one has him in maybe, uh, what does he have? Um, is Cavs jersey maybe on? I don't know. I know there's one other one or maybe a home jersey. Um, so there's two, there's two of these, and they come up with two different prices, which is kind of confusing. So we have home, let's see, yeah, total home. This is LeBron James, vaulted 2013. Yeah, old pop, man, 2013 NBA, really cool piece. Coming in at $280? I need to check this again. $280? 
Um, maybe. I've seen some other ones go a little higher, but I think definitely this one will probably be going up. Uh, of course, you know, LeBron James is definitely uh, one that a lot of people have wanted over the years. Um, and these old NBA pops, I've had a couple in the past um, that were damaged and not in great condition, but this one looks in really good condition. I'm not going to take it out of the stack right now. But I will take it out of the stack and look at it and probably move it up to some pop armor. Probably deserve some pop armor. But let's see. So this is, yeah, the, the Miami one is different. The Miami jersey is different than the Cavs jersey. So the Miami jersey is actually the older one. And it is coming in at $280. Check the pop price guide. So there's different variants, like I said. This is $280. So already coming in with some big heat. This might be big piece of the heat but $346 total right now um hmm I like this one it's a good one it might be one to keep for down the road I don't know might be a great one that NBA collector you're looking for that one especially in good condition like it is I would be all right so got one other in a stack here a regular stack I don't know what's front or back I don't want to peek too much because I don't want to give away what's in there all right, so one, two, three. Oh, it's, it's Elvira, Elvira, Mistress of the Dark. Oh, and it's a Diamond Edition 2500 piece from October 2019. So last year, um, Spooky Empire, they're the ones that put on this event that she goes to and has this pop. Usually it's signed a lot of times too, you'll find her signing it. But Elvira, this is a nice one. The purple has the purple dress. Definitely a cool piece to check out. So let's see what she's coming in at. Elvira. Hmm. Elvira. Another grail. Man, stack. Stacks on stacks on stacks tonight. Let's see. Elvira, and this is what number? 375. So. Didn't scan her. Probably should. Let's see. She's coming at 125. Uh, not too bad, 125, a nice grail, um, definitely different variants, like different dresses and stuff she's had over the years, um, different colors worth more, like a red dress, an orange dress, but this one's 125, still not a bad value, so I think we did well, plus 125, we're coming at 471, um, so we still got a little ways to go to get to our value, so I'm guessing we got two pretty decent sized pops in here. Um, let's see what they are. Like I said, I'll save that pop armor for last. If you put in a pop armor, and these ones are just in stacks, I'm guessing that pop armor one is probably your top one. Let's see, I can't tell front or back, so we're just going to guess on this one. Um, this feels like the top of it. One, two, three. Oh, turn it around. I've had a couple of these. Um, I still have one actually over here, but this is a great glow pop. Great glow chase i think these are coming around like 150 or so but skeleton glow chase from the funko shop i see this going back up over time as well too um just because this one is i mean it was a chase it was hard to get and it's great corpse bride one great for halloween of course um it was going for almost like 300 dollars plus for a little while there um kind of calmed down now it's about 145 but i see it going back up over time um just because it is a glow chase there's not a lot of glow chases like this that are funko shop exclusives so you're not going to see a restock of this or anything like that so well, let's see so we got 145 all right so we're coming at 616 so at least to get the value i need 100 dollars. hoping this grail is a lot more than that i don't know we'll have to find out ready to get into this last grail. Hoping this is a big one. Let's see. All right, I'm ready. Let's go for it. Uh, a stack, a pop armor. This is the way to do it. This is the kind of stack I like to hear. Um, pop armor is my kind of stack. You got that magnetic top, so we know what the top is. I don't know if front or back is. I'm excited and nervous at the same time. This, I'm hoping this is a two, $300 at least grail, maybe plus that. Um, for what I paid for this box, has to be over a decent amount of value. So one, two, three. Oh, a different, oh, different side here. Oh, this one is 
definitely not for me, but a lot of people out there, this is definitely a grail. Um, it's not one I collect, Golden Frieza, but the Red Eye Golden Frieza, I know has a lot of great value to it. Um, probably coming in around the two to three hundred dollar mark, so I was probably right about that. So a cool piece, though. Definitely, man. The metallic look on him looks awesome. He is in this, you know. I think I think uh, LeBron needs one of these stacks too because he's coming in at some great value um, from San Diego Comic Con 2015. I don't know how many were made. They don't have like a limited number, but it is a con pop that a lot of people look for because it's the Red Eye Golden Frieza. Um, definitely harder to find. We've got 260 coming in at 260. So let's see what kind of value we got. Plus 260. So we're coming at 876. A little lower in value, but pop price guides up and down all the time. Thought I was going to be coming in at like 900 or so, but I paid seven, about 720 for the box, that kind of thing. So still we're coming in $150 over value. Can't beat that. Some of these are probably worth more than that. Oh, LeBron James, I'm sorry. He's probably worth a lot more than you know, what he's saying. Um, I seen that skeleton glow chase go for a lot more. I know this one is pretty wanted by any kind of Dragon Ball Z collector. So, you know, some of these, the lower end ones, eh, they're, they're what they are. They're like $30, $40 pops in kind of that range, definitely. So I was glad to get a really cool box. Like I said, we are stacking some grails. Let's get out these grails. It was a nice thick box, well protected, no damage to these. Like I said, Elvira is a great one. So we, we did get some Halloween, like we said, we got the Halloween pop. We got the, we got some NBA. We didn't get any Marvel. So I didn't get any like my collection, like Marvel and Star Wars and some of the stuff. But Elvira is a cool one. Um, skeleton I already have, or I would definitely keep. And then LeBron James is just one to hold on to for a while, I think. He's going to go, those NBA pops go crazy up sometimes. Um, but man, we got some, we got the grails, we got the grails. These are four stacks that are bringing in some awesome value. Man, that's a crazy box. I haven't done a box like that, but I wasn't going to lose. That's the nice thing about it. It was a mystery box. I was always going to come out ahead on. Um, so that's the kind of mystery box I like. Um, I didn't even know what was going to be in it though, too. So that's a crazy one. You have to let me know in the comments what is your favorite one what what do you think about a mystery box like that where you know you're going to come 100 to 200 dollars over value um with the box is it and it's still a crazy amount of money but it is like that you're going to get all those grails and they might not be all for you but you're getting the money back the guaranteed value back so it could be a great thing with those um i don't know you have to let me know so again what do you need to do you need to like this video if you enjoyed all these crazy grails. You enjoyed the Batgirl chase, some of the other stuff we pulled. Um, and what else do you need to do? You need to like this video, uh, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and then come back for some more videos and come back and join me on my live tonight. So if you're watching this on Monday, I do a live at 9.30. I'm going to do it on YouTube. we got mail call live tonight. So hopefully you can join us all the time, some different lives we get, we got going on. But every Monday night, 9.30, I have something going on. Hopefully you can join us and have some fun. And we're ready for a big, big duel on Thursday. You won't want to miss this video when my wife and I, we're going to have a crazy duel. You can't miss out. All right, everyone. Have a good one. We'll see you later. Hey, it's Professor Josh. Guess what? We're doing stacks. We're doing stacks on top of stacks on top of stacks on top of stacks today. You won't believe what I'm going to get all in this box. You won't believe it. So come back and check it out. We'll see you soon.